So today I'm gonna show you guys how to make a very clean but good looking camera border for you on Twitch. Just like this one. Ta-da! And I think a very good camera border is a very important thing on Twitch because Twitch is such a personal platform. It has this interaction between streamers and viewers and I think a good way to strengthen the bond between those is by having a good camera border which uh, turns the attention to you. So if you're really bad at photo editing or you're just really lazy, don't worry, I got you covered. I have all these colorful camera borders that I will leave down in the description below for you to download for free. So let's hop right into it. I have Photoshop. If you don't have Photoshop, you can download GIMP, uh, which is a free editing software, photo edit editing software, uh, which is very similar to Photoshop. I'll leave it uh, down in the description. Uh, or you can just download some of the borders I've already made. I'll leave that. All right, I'll leave that in the description. So we start out with a 90 by 20 uh, canvas. I have a black background right now. Uh, make sure to unlock that so we can edit it. Um, if you have a white background, just take your, take your paint bucket and fill it in black. That's no problem. So what we do, I like taking this polygonal lasso tool and just uh, cut up a nice shape, just like I've done with my current camera border. Just cut out an interesting shape you like. It doesn't have to be symmetric, but it might be nice if it is symmetric. So you just cut these things out with control, control and X, all right? So this is not the best looking thing, but it's just to illustrate how this works. So when you have this black, you have to make sure this these are cubes, so you know it's a transparent background. And so what we do is export or save this as a PNG file. And we're, we're gonna call it mask.png. Save, oh, mask, save. All right, so what we do then is take this uh, layer and we're gonna resize it a little bit. And you have, you, you have to hold shift on GIMP, but you have to not hold shift on Photoshop to resize it to keep the aspect ratio, as you can see. Uh, then we're gonna put it in the middle. Oh, it's a little bit small. I'm gonna put it in the middle. You'll see, is, you'll see that it's the middle if it has the purple lines on both the Y and the X axes. Then we're gonna add another layer, like so. We're gonna go to the black layer and select all pixels. Then we're gonna do select, modify, expand by 10 pixels or maybe thicker, thinner, according to what you like and what fits your stream best. We're gonna hit okay. We're gonna select the other layer and then you can either uh, get the paint bucket and just dump on a color you like. We're gonna move it below. Or what I like to do is get a gradient tool. If you feel a little fancy, you can set up a gradient here if you want. You can pick a color, any color you want. Uh, let's do a blue one with, I think the yellow one looks pretty good. Then we're just gonna drag the way you like it. Maybe you like it more like this. All right, and then to preview how it will look is just select these pixels again, and then select the other layer, and then we're gonna cut that out. And as you can see, this will be the camera border. Looks pretty good, right? So you're gonna save this one as a PNG as well. .png. Just go to your video capture device, right click it, and go to filters. Add a filter and go to image mask slash blend. Here you'll uh, alpha mask, alpha channels, good one. Look for the camera mask, select the mask. As you can see, it has cropped it to the, the mask we just created. Just save. You can either drop this image in OBS uh, just as a PNG or you can upload it to your uh, source, your browser source, but I'm just gonna do it in an image just to show you how to do it. Select the border. Then we're gonna resize it until it fits nicely on the camera. I like it when it's a little, it's a little bit floating, right? So, there we go. That's it, that's how you make a very simple but clean looking camera border that will capture the attention of your viewer.
If you have any questions, just hop in my stream, link down below, ask me any questions you have uh, about this video or any other videos, and I will see you guys next time.